The Philadelphia Eagles aren't the only thing people are talking about when it comes to the Super Bowl. Apart from the Eagles' win, Pink's pitch perfect performance of the national anthem, the part of the Super Bowl that always gets people talking is the halftime show. This year, singer Justin Timberlake took center stage at the U.S. National Bank Stadium in Minneapolis to perform a 13-minute set. The star sang from his repertoire of hits including, Sexy Back, Can't Stop the Feeling, and, I Would Die For You, a tribute song to the late great Prince. Although the performance was amazing, viewers weren't all but happy. With Justin's tribute considering Prince's views on JT, the halftime show included a tribute to Prince. Using a hologram of the late singer, Twitter, users were quick to point out how Prince not only disliked technology as the one used to display the singer, but his harsh words used in the past when talking about Justin. Related, Pink shines in Super Bowl performance while battling flu although many were furious over the use of Prince's voice and image. One person, in particular, was not. Tyka Nelson, Prince's sister, told TMZ that she was pleasantly surprised by Timberlake's performance and even enjoyed his controversial Prince tribute. Nelson once the JT haters to back off and truly feels Prince himself would not have minded the slightest with Timberlake using his voice. The family was also notified that Timberlake was planning to sing the Prince hit but didn't know there would be a hologram of the Purple Rain singer. The irony behind this performance is Prince's past comments about holograms used in concerts. The late singer once said, he hated duets between living and deceased artists, and referred to such performances as demonic, so perhaps he would not have been that fine with this year's halftime show. Despite Prince's past statements, it doesn't seem to be bothering his sister Justin at all. So it may be a good idea to let this one go and move on. Next, the highest attended Super Bowls of all time.